Hi, this is Andrew again from DPS, and today I'm going to tell you about the three different ways that you can get an R2 evaluation unit to test out in your real network. Choosing an RTU for your organization is a very important decision. This is a device that uses up a significant amount of your budget dollars, and it's something that you'll need to use for 5, 10, maybe even 20 years. This is going to affect not only you, but many other people at your organization, so you want to make the right choice. The best way to do that is to test out a potential RTU in your lab, or maybe out at an actual remote site, to see how it interacts with the various protocols and other devices that are in your network, and what the user experience is like. So let's start by looking at the first of our ways that you can get an eval RTU to test out using a money-back guarantee. Using a money-back guarantee to get yourself an evaluation RTU may not be what you expected, but it actually works incredibly well. All you need to do is find yourself a manufacturer who has a satisfaction, money-back, no-risk type guarantee, maybe a 30-day window or a 60-day window, and you'll just tell that manufacturer, look, I'm gonna buy one of your RTUs, and if it works, that's great, I'll know that it works on my network and I'll buy a lot more units. But if it doesn't, I want to be able to take advantage of your guarantee, no questions asked, ship it back to you, tear up the invoice, and I'll be done. That's an excellent way to get yourself an RTU if you can issue a PO. But at some organizations, especially larger ones, it's really difficult to go through purchasing, especially if you might have to do this for one, two, three, four eval RTUs that you're going to be evaluating. So if you do have that trouble and it's tough to issue that PO, even if there is a money back guarantee in place, we come to our second way that you can get yourself an evaluation RTU using a loaner agreement. A loaner agreement offers essentially the same easy experience that you would get with a money back guarantee, except it eliminates the need to issue a PO for your evaluation unit beforehand. It's usually just a one page form that you'll get emailed to you, you'll sign it, and it's really just a memorandum of understanding. The manufacturer is saying, we are shipping you this one RTU, it is understood that this is an evaluation unit, you have 30, 60, 90 days, whatever the period is, to evaluate this, and at that point, you agree that you'll either ship it back to us or be invoiced for it. So it's essentially the money-back guarantee experience, but you don't have to issue a PO, and that can just be an amazing convenience at some companies. That brings us to our third and final way that you can get an RTU eval, this is really my favorite, the field trial. A field trial is the ultimate RTU evaluation experience. This isn't when you just need one or two RTUs, but if you're looking at deploying 10 or 20 or more remotes, you really can get a manufacturer who will say, we'll send a team out there to work with you for a few days and really make sure that this thing is a perfect fit. We might need to develop a slightly different firmware feature, make an adjustment to our, the way we handle a protocol. There are many different things that can come up, and if you're looking at a substantial deployment, you should really find a manufacturer who is forward-looking enough to say, yes, we'll send a team out to you, we'll help you work it out because we don't want anything to go wrong because this is a significant project for you and we want it to go exactly right. If you'd like to get an eval unit to test out an RTU in your network using any of the three methods I described here today, I encourage you to reach out to me. Just use the link below. If you found this video helpful, please click the like button, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you can see more videos like this one. Until next time, I wish you excellent network reliability.